In this video, we are going to discuss that how we can combine data from multiple tables into a single table in Microsoft Excel. Here we have four sheets in which we have details of employees including employee name, country, department, designation and salary details. Let's say we want to combine data from these four sheets or from these four tables into a single table. So what is the best and quickest way to combine this data? For this, first of all, we need to create a new sheet in which we will be creating the table with combined data from these four tables. Then we need to select heading. We need to copy heading from any of these tables and we need to simply paste in this new sheet. Now next step is we need to use here vstack function equal sign vstack function open parentheses. In this vstack function we will select these four tables one by one. But one thing that you need to care about is that you need to select these tables in the same order you want to bring data here from these four tables. Let's say first of all or on the top we want to bring data from this management sheet or from this management employees table. So what we will do, we will go to this management sheet and we will select that of these employees without heading. Then we will insert comma, then we will go to the second sheet that we want to bring after this management employees. Let's say we want to bring finance, then sales, then at last production employees data. So we will go to this finance sheet, we will select employees details, then we will insert comma, we will go to the sales sheet, we will select this employee details without heading, insert comma, at last we will go to this production sheet, we will select details of all of these employees and then we will close parenthesis and press enter. You can see instantly we have been combined these four tables into this one table. You can see the order of employees is, is exactly same in the in which order we select data from these sheets. First of all, we have employees from management, then we have finance, then we have sales and at last we have production employees data. The one thing that you need to take care about is that this combined data or data in this combined table is dependent on these original tables. If we change anything in this original tables or original data, the data will be changed accordingly in this combined table. Let's say for this first employee from management department, I will change department name. I will go to this original sheet. I will change from department from management into HR. Then I will go to this combined table and you will see by itself it has been updated this information. If I will go back, I will just undo it. The department has been changed from HR to management. You will see that a department has been also updated accordingly in this combined table. In this way, you can instantly and quickly combine multiple tables into a single table in Microsoft Excel. So friends, that's all for today. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe.